Rated as the best keyboard of 2015. Also, it is amongst the best picks of the editors. It is available on Play Store and that too for free. You simply need to go to Play Store and write Swift Key Keyboard in the search bar and install the app. It is for those of you who want to show off your keyboard. Trust me, Swift Key comes packed with various themes which are very beautiful and mainly it suits your style. It's so easy to use and I love the many options from different themes. Well, let's open the app. It is very personalizable. It learns your writing style, your most used words and even the emojis you like to use from your sent emails and messages. It displays a wide variety of themes in attractive colors. You see, talking about themes, we cannot ignore the fact that all these themes are absolutely free and does not cost you even a penny. Also, it provides the number pad on the same page where the alphabets are displayed which is a feature that is not provided by many keyboards. You simply need to enable this. It allows you to sync your keyboard with Google so as to save your progress and use that progress in other devices. It allows you to change the layout of your keyboard namely into QWERTY, AZERTY, COLIMAC, VOROC, QUERTS and QUERTZY. Also, it allows you to change your language into almost every language you are aware of. It contains each and every language you see. Helps you customize the way you type. It gives you an option to resize your keyboard if you want your phone to vibrate when you type. Clipboard which helps you to store things you copied and changes regarding keys and other voice input. Also has some unique features which I didn't see before. Some of them are typing heat map which shows you the region where you press the alphabets to type. Just a minute. It's happening see. Means I press R in this region and U and F or J for example. It has a very comfortable and easy to use swipe typing method. It helps you write a hundred times faster than your usual speed. For example, I'll write You saw? So many apps. Swift key also has some downs. They are, it does not provide you a method to customize your keyboard background which is a feature in most of the keyboards. By this, I mean that you cannot put the image you want in the background of your keyboard. The themes are not very customizable. Also, it adds a typo to its dictionary quite easily. Now, if you ask me to rate the app out of 5, I will give it a 4 because of the above mentioned reasons. Now, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up and do share it. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel. For further details, please visit www.livofi.com. Also, you can read news from all around the world, food reviews, product reviews, some beautifully clipped pictures, read technology related articles. Also, you can check out the fiction category and find yourself something interesting to read. Okay, goodbye.